As charged in the first article of impeachment, President Trump has demonstrated that he will remain a threat to national security and the Constitution if allowed to remain in office and has acted in a manner grossly incompatible with self-governance and the rule of law. Based on the abuse of power for which he was impeached and his ongoing efforts to solicit foreign interference, both directly and through Mr. Giuliani, there can be little doubt that President Trump will continue to invite foreign interference in our elections again and again. That poses an imminent threat to the integrity of our democracy. Our founders understood that a president like Donald Trump might one day grasp the reins of power. An unremorseful, overreaching executive, faithful to himself only, and willing to sacrifice our democracy and national security for his own personal advantage. His pattern of conduct repeatedly soliciting foreign interference in our elections for his own benefit confirms that he will stop at nothing to retain his power. He willfully chose to place his own personal interests above the country's and the integrity of our elections. There is every reason to believe that will continue. He has stonewalled Congress and ordered executive branch agencies, organizations that work for the American people, not for the president, to join in his obstruction. He deployed Mr. Giuliani to Ukraine to continue advancing a scheme that serves no other purpose than advancing his 2020 re-election prospects. He attacked witnesses, public servants, patriots, who stayed true to their oath and leveled with the American people about the grave national injury that resulted from the president's misconduct. And he continued to urge foreign nations to investigate American citizens that he views as a threat. The threat that he will continue to abuse his power and cause grave harm to the nation over the course of the next year until a new president is sworn in or until he would be reelected is not hypothetical. Merely exposing the president's scheme has not stopped him from continuing this destructive pattern of behavior that has brought us to this somber moment. He is who he is. That will not change and nor will the danger associated with him. Every piece of evidence supports that terrible conclusion that the President of the United States will abuse his power again, that he will continue to solicit foreign interference to help corruptly secure his reelection. He has shown neither remorse nor acknowledgement of wrongdoing if you can believe that July 25th was a perfect call, that asking for investigations of your political opponents and using the power of your office to make it so is perfectly fine, then there is nothing that would stop you from doing it again. President Trump has abused the power of his office and must be removed from that office. Mr. McConnell, I yield back.